In this video, I'm sharing three realistic ways to care for your dog's coat. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel, where we share Shiba Inu tips and tricks and also daily funny life with our dogs video. Subscribe to get all the tips you need to raise a happy dog. Now, without further ado, let's get right to it. Before we dive in specifics, a dog's coat is an important barrier for your dog in order to keep him warm in winter and cool in summer. A dog's coat will also protect the, the skin from water, dirt, or other debris from the environment. For the most part, if there is an underlying health issue with your dog, you will be able to observe it from the coat, maybe a hot spot, a flea bite, a bacterial infection, or others. Those underlying conditions will all reflect on a dog's coat if you observe him closely. Similar to human skin, what you eat will impact how your skin looks, but also your activity level, stress level, how you sleep, all those factors play a part when it comes to the look of your skin. And of course, there are cosmetic items you can use to improve your skin. Same concept goes along with your dog's coat. While his diet plays a main factor, which we will go right in after this, there are other factors you should consider. Are you exercising your dog enough daily? Are you spending enough time with him to satisfy his social needs? From time to time, are you taking your dogs out to get some sunshine not only will boost his energy, but sun can be a natural disinfection for his skin too. While his diet certainly plays a main role in the health of his coat, in order to keep a healthy skin, there are a lot more than just feeding quality food. And that brings us to the second point, the diet. You are what you eat. Same concept goes along with your dog's diet, and as a result, your dog's coat condition will reflect on whether he has been provided enough nutrient and a well-balanced diet. A dog's daily nutritional needs includes protein, carbohydrates, fats, vitamins, minerals, and last but not least, water. Protein and fat should be the main source of energy for your canine friend. If you take a look at your dog food label, typically protein should consist around 30% of each meal, following the fat, roughly 10-15%. to 15 Then there are other minerals and vitamins included in the meal. To make sure the dog food you buy has the right mix of nutrients, Look for the words like complete and balanced nutrition on the label. You might also see meets the nutritional requirements of dogs established by the American Association of Feed Control Officials, AAFCO, or complete and balanced nutrition for dogs based on AAFCO feeding trials. If you are feeding your dog high quality and well-balanced dog food, the dry food should have included all his daily nutritional needs. We occasionally give Jimmy some salmon or sprinkle some fish oil on his food as an omega-3 boost for him. Because omega-3 fatty acids is great for overall skin and coat health. Also, dog body does not produce omega-3 on its own, so make sure he gets enough of those fatty acids to keep a healthy coat. For dogs that are double-coated, like Shiba Inu, might require more often brushing. Brush your dog frequently to remove the falling hair and also help to distribute the natural oil barrier evenly throughout the body. I do not have a specific time frame for how often you should brush him. For Jimmy, we brush him roughly once a week when he is not shedding. 
During shedding season, we brush him almost daily to get the excessive hair out. Do not bathe your dog too often unless your vet recommends you to do so. Dog's natural coat should be a natural oil barrier to keep his skin clean of debris and moisture. Bathe your dog too often can cause dry skin. We bathe Jimmy roughly once every three months. When selecting shampoo, make sure you get one that is specifically for dogs. Choose the one that doesn't have any strong perfume or scent, as those scent can be too strong for your dog. I will leave a link down below for the oats shampoo we use for Jimmy if you want to check it out. When it comes to caring for the coat, like mentioned at the beginning of this video, it takes more than just the food to maintain a healthy coat. When selecting dog food, make sure you look at the label closely. Select the highest quality food that fit into your budget. Look at the ingredients list to ensure it provides all the vital nutrients your dog needs. Provide him daily exercise like walks or playtime to ensure he gets his daily dosage of activity and social needs. Bathe him once every three months or less. I hope you find the information helpful. If you like to see more content like this, remember to like and leave me a comment below to let me know. To learn more about first-time dog owners tips and tricks, check out the video on the screen to learn more. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.